Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel Ray and I'm really excited to share this with you today. This is the Black Needle Society's Happy Hour Stitching Box. This is a bi-monthly subscription box from the Black Needle Society and if you're not currently subscribed to them, please check out their website. There's a wait list at the top of the website page for you to sign up to become a subscriber, but it's really cool. So every two months they give you a box like this and I am a rep for this company. So they have kindly sent me the box to share with you so that you can see what's in the box. Maybe it'll give you an idea of whether you want to sign up or not. Um, but thank you, Black Needle Society team, for sending me this box. My box did arrive very late uh, in comparison to other creators. So you may have seen this already, in which case, feel free to skip it. It's fine. I understand. Uh, but I'm really excited to finally open this. So let's get into it. There is tape here. I love how heavy duty and, you know, really secure these boxes are. So... Fingers crossed that nothing is broken. Here we go. All right. So first things first is on top. We have the, oh, this is such a beautiful image. Happy hour stitching with two martini stitcher. First, if you don't know two martini stitcher, please check out her channel. I will, uh, I will link her down below in the description box of this video, but in here, it's going to tell us everything that's inside the box, which I don't want to look at because I want to be surprised as much as possible. I have been spoiled a little bit, but um, there is a letter from the society. It says here that uh, we had some wonderful and excited individuals respond to uh, sharing the contents on of these boxes on their channels. And Aaron was among the reps. It seemed like a fun idea to make a happy hour box. Um, they threw out some suggestions and decided to add it to the roster of box ideas. As we began to plan our first anniversary box, it only seemed right to toast a wonderful first year with a happy hour theme and to toast those who supported us from the beginning. We want to say thank you to Erin for sending some of her ideas for items and businesses. La la la. Uh, let us know what your favorite cocktail is. Ooh, can you put that in the comments? I would love to know what your favorite is. Um, the next subscription box is not Mermaids, Unicorns, and Dragons. It's actually Steampunk Stitching. Cannot wait to share with the, you that in March. Uh, but this is the May box that we're going to have. Uh, Mermaids, Unicorns, and Dragons. Oh my. Cannot wait for that. And then there is a photo challenge, which I'm not going to read right now because, again, spoilers. But can you see everything? Yes. Okay, good. So let's start. First, we have the needle minder. This is an exclusive retreat in a box needle minder. Oh, that's cute. It says always happy hour. Two little martinis. How cute is that? Oh, I love it. I really like that. That's sweet. Let me put that to the side. Next up, we have Live and Die LA, hand-dyed embroidery floss, 10-yard skeins. Okay, let me get this out so you don't hear the crinkle. So here's her business card, Live and Die LA, hand-dyed fabrics and floss. Check her out, or them out. Sorry, I don't know if it's a woman or a man, but we have Tequila Sunrise. Look how pretty. <gasps> We have Bordeaux. I love rich browns like that. And Melon Illusion. Very pretty. So we've got floss and the needle minder. What else do we want to get out of here? Let me go ahead for this big box first. Let's get the big, big boxes out of the way. Ooh. Okay, this is the one that I was spoiled on. This is a wine glass and it says cheers. <gasps> How beautiful. Look at that. Okay, it was made in China, but still. <laughs> 
Oh, that's gorgeous. I cannot wait to use this. I don't know if they knew this was coming or not, but I am running out of wine glasses. They keep breaking. I don't know. Do they have a lifespan? Who knows? But it says cheers. This is my new favorite glass now. <laughs> Thank you. What else do we have? Oh, let me get that other big box out of the way. Let's fold that stuff down. Ooh, what's this? It's liquid. Pull up my sleeve. What does it say? Frambois Thaw. Spiced apple cider, dry gin, shaker and spoon tart, raspberry syrup, heavy cream and cinnamon. Oh, this makes a cocktail. Hang on. Tart raspberry syrup. <gasps> Ooh. Hang on. I wish there was smell of vision Oh, it smells so good. Oh my gosh. So spiced apple cider. So I think that's meant for Americans. If you are in Europe, <laughs> this is not, this is not alcoholic. So you could probably use apple juice, um, gin, the syrup, Heavy cream and cinnamon. Oh, I'm going to try it, but I'm going to wait until my birthday. <laughs> my birthday is coming up, so I will I will try that. That is so cool. Thank you. It, it only makes sense for a happy hour box, right? Then it looks like we have a project bag. Okay, got it out of the box. It says, it's stitch o'clock somewhere. <laughs> How cool. It's a tote bag. It's got a beautiful purple on the inside there is a gorgeous I mean this is really heavy duty the straps are really tough um is that cotton but wow that is a really beautiful bag I like that a lot now I'm not usually a fan of like open bags so I might put it in a clasp or a button or something but <gasps> I like that a lot. That's cool. That's really cool. A nice project bag. What's this? <gasps> Ooh, look at that. They're pins. Exclusive pin set. Lemon, pickled onion, and olive. Very neat. Then we have, oh, look at this. <gasps> Y'all, I know what this is. So, did you, have you seen me uh, eat while I'm stitching before? But um, <laughs> this is snack chopsticks. And it's like, you can keep doing whatever you're doing and also grab yourself a snack. So uh, let me, let me demonstrate. This probably isn't the best thing, but this is gonna, I'm just gonna show you. Um, in here, I have all these candies. Imagine that these are chips or something, and you just grab it and then feed yourself. Um, num, num, num. Uh, <laughs> that is such a good idea. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm sorry. I'm probably too excited about this, but I always eat my snacks with chopsticks when I'm stitching because then my fingers don't get all messy. That's what is going to happen here. <gasps> You could probably use it on, you know, whatever hand you want. I am right-handed, so it's easier for me to, to do it with the right hand. But I think with practice, you could absolutely get it to work with whatever hand you want. And then lastly, we have fabric and a pattern. So the fabric is Seraphim, 5 o'clock somewhere, BNS exclusive, 32 count linen. It is beautiful. This is my first ever Seraphim fabrics. And this color, oh, it's gorgeous. It's like, it's a little bit more on the lighter yellow side. Kind of like that. Then green, it's showing up green. But this is a little bit like a highlighter yellow color with a bit of green added to the dye. <gasps> Gorgeous. And so that goes with this pattern from Ink Circles. This is called Five O'Clock. Look at 
that. That looks like so much fun to stitch. <gasps> Can you identify all the drinks in this pattern? Look at all the beautiful stirs that are the border. <gasps> that is so cute. So on the back, 151 by 151. It's a design size over two threads of linen on 30 count. It's a 10 by 10. Cross stitch is two plies. So two threads of DMC in the, these colors. There are no fractional or specialty stitches, so it's nice and easy. Uh, now the model was 30 count Dove Linen by Weeks Dye Works, but we're gonna use the Seraphim fabric. Ah, so cool. That is awesome. So we have the exclusive pattern, the fabric. We've got this beautiful needle minder to go with it. I'm actually gonna attach it to the pattern itself so I can make sure that I use it. I'm gonna use these pins as well. Uh, let's see where the pins come from. So now I'm gonna go ahead and look at that piece of paper that I put away and let you know. So needle minder was designed by the Black Needle Society. Uh, let's see, wine glass was inspired by Aaron's Floss Tube Closing Line Cheers <laughs> to create this wine glass. Again, watch her floss tube, it's really fun. Uh, we have tart raspberry simple syrup. Erin regularly subscribes to and enjoys Shaker and Spoon subscription boxes. She asked if it would be possible for us to partner with them to bring you simple syrup from their collection. <gasps> That is so cool. Um, the tote bag, Blanca Design. Cool. I'm going to have to look them up. Then we have the counting pin set. Oh, it's a counting pin set. Cute. You can also use it to uh, a soft, fully finished project. So a fully finished project is one that is completely finished, you know, either framed or made into an object. So I think that's what I'm going to do with these. I'm going to stick these in somewhere. If I make a pillow out of it, I'll just stick them in the top and make it really cute. Snacking and crafting finger chopsticks. Very cool. Um, exclusive five o'clock fabric. Erin asked Lori of Seraphim to create a green olive inspired fabric. It's not the call for fabric, but we think it may be a great option. And then... We are, design we are thrilled to include another custom pattern in our subscription boxes from Tracy over at Ink Circles. Erin specifically chose Tracy to create her dream happy hour pattern for this box, and we agree she was the perfect choice. Grab a cocktail and enjoy the stitch. That is so cool. Now, as you can see, the date that I am recording this video is like the, I don't even know what date it is, around the 18th of February. It only just arrived. So uh, unfortunately, I can't join in on this, but I will do my best to, to take a few photos and share with you all over on Instagram. And uh, it's no, no fault of theirs. It just got held up in Irish customs forever. Uh, but yeah, look at this. We have uh, some spotlights from Instagram. So please share what's in your box using the hashtag if you do sign up to get one of these subscription boxes. We love seeing the pictures just as much as you like taking them. So y'all, thank you so much for watching this video. If you have questions, um, please, I would recommend that you sign up for the newsletter, especially if you are waiting to, to get your subscription box. Does that make sense? Um, that way you can stay up to date with what's going on at the Black Needle Society. And they do, they do make a newsletter that's quite detailed. And I highly, highly recommend it. I'm just gonna pop everything back in the box. But if there's something that I can help you with, I will absolutely down in the comments section. I do appreciate that you come and watch these videos. Let me know what you think and please tell me what is your favorite cocktail or what was your favorite cocktail if you don't drink 
any longer that's okay too uh and if you don't drink at all that's that's cool too no worries no pressure um but thank you so much for watching this video and thank you to the black needle society for sending this box so that i could share it with all of my subscribers i hope you all have a fantastic day a great week ahead and i will see you in my next one take care everyone bye